had a really really good Christmas um, I thought I'd just film a really quick vlog and basically show you my sewing related Christmas presents which are awesome so um, but before I do that just one really quick exciting development in my sewing world is that I have a new sewing machine um, so this is a Brother NV1300, Innovis NV1300 and um, I haven't actually had a chance to properly um, test drive it all out. I have made a dress using this um, but it was just you, you know using a basic straight stitch so I want time to you know try out things like twin needling and different stitches and all of that um, which I haven't had a chance to do yet. But what I will say is this was a breeze to use for that dress and I did use sequin fabric so it wasn't the easiest uh, fabrics to use um, but it was absolutely no problem. Um, so yeah, I'll be able to tell you a bit more about this once I've actually, you know, properly used it. But what I will show you is this feature which I love is that all of the reel and um, bobbin winder and everything that you have on top of the sewing machine is actually hidden, which is so cool. I love that. It's just a nice, I think it's just a nice clean look and finish. So I'm very, very much obsessed with this at the minute and trying out all of its little features because it's got so many bells and whistles going on, it's unreal. Um, so yeah, this is my new sewing machine and I also do have a new overlocker to match <laughs> so this is a brother uh, lock 3034DWT um, and again I did use that for my most recent dress and um, it was brilliant it just it, it handled the fabric no problem and just glided through but you know again I really want to properly test drive with different fabrics and everything and um, fiddle around with all the settings and everything so very very happy about these <laughs> not my muscles <laughs> the sewing machine and overlocker so yeah there'll be more to follow on that so let me show you my Christmas presents so I'll start with patterns because I've got two patterns and so the first is da -da! A named Sloan sweatshirt. I don't know if you can see that okay. I don't think you can. There. So yeah, this is um this is kind of a basic sweatshirt style, but um I think so I've made a couple of Lindens and this is really similar, but um I think it's got a couple I can't actually see on the picture on the front, but from memory I think it had a couple of darts on the bodice. So um I wanted to try that out as well to see how the neckline was on that one because the linden's quite wide so um, this looked a, a little bit narrower so I'll give that a try I really want to just um, try out a whole bunch of different sweatshirt patterns um, so I've got an I am lion coming up and obviously I've made a linden and I want to make this to try as well and then following on from that I also received um, so this is an I am patterns again, which I'm slightly obsessed with. So this is an I am zebra, zebra. I don't know how to pronounce that in a French kind of way. Zebra, Ze zebra. I don't know, but there it is. <laughs> so what I love about I am patterns is so this um this pattern and I am lion as well, which I'm making. They've both got a real um, like statement style feature. So I Am Lion has some like ruched shoulders and um, this one has fairly like, if you can see like fairly long cuffs and then beyond the cuff it sort of balloons and puffs out. Um, so yeah, I really want to give that one a try as well to see how I like that. So there'll be some sweatshirt review pattern wise things coming up really soon. So there are my two patterns I got for Christmas. So next I received two pieces of fabric 
and one of them I asked for and one of them was a surprise from my husband which is kind of amazing um I I still write I'm 32 years old and I do still write a Christmas list and birthday list um so he went a bit off piste but he did he totally smashed it it's really cool but I'll show you the the first piece of fabric first um which I did ask for and I've wanted for ages um so this was I believe this was purchased from um so me sunshine um which is a really cool fabric website if you haven't been on there go check it out so this is -da, um some really gorgeous atelier brunette um sweatshirting so I think this one's called twinkle or something like that anyway but it's basically navy blue um which I love obviously um, with some tiny little gold flecks all over it and it's gorgeous um, so I've seen lots of people um, sew, sew jumpers and stuff out of this so I'm really looking forward to it I don't, I don't know which jumper I'll make but one of my patterns um, and I'll get this sewn up into something really snuggly and cosy and beautiful so yeah that's my first piece of fabric present um, so yeah this is the next one is um, the piece of fabric that my husband bought and it is so beautiful. I had been looking at this online but I'll be honest it was really really expensive so I never got it in the end but he'd obviously seen over my shoulder when I was on the laptop. Um, so this from Guthrie and Garney is 100% silk um, crepe gorgeousness Ta -da! and it's I don't know I'd probably call it a royal blue I don't think it'll come out looking royal blue on the video but um, you can see how stunning it is how much drape it's got um, it's absolutely stunning um, and I just want to stroke it it's so slinky and soft I think I'm gonna make a dress because um, I think it's got me like two and a half meters so um, I think I'm gonna make a possibly a by hand London Alex dress from this um, I've got a wedding to go to in March so I think that would be perfect and I think it goes with my hair um, I love it so thank you husband <laughs> So they're the patterns and fabrics. I got a few like sewing accessory gadget type things. Um, so I'll start with firstly to say these are all from the website Beyond Measure. Um, if you haven't been on there, um, you need to. <laughs> it's um, there's some gorgeous like handmade type like sewing gadgets accessories. Um, and it's all like quite premium posh stuff so um, I'll start with this that my mother-in-law really kindly got for me so this is um, it says this is a solid beach wood block um, and it's magnetic so if you can see that if my camera will focus on that um, yeah it's basically this wooden block so it's flat on the bottom and um, it's for, you can store your pins in or on top, so you can use it either way. Um, so just to show you, um, if I just grab some pins without falling off my chair. Oops. Um, so if you see, I can just store my pins on there. I think I, I like it that way. I think that looks quite contemporary um yeah so i'll take that label off there we go but how cool is that so i'm gonna have that on my sewing table um with my pins all stored on top so thank you very much <laughs> um and then i also got some um snippers so these come, um, they're like, they're Japanese. I think uh, the brand says Kohana. Um, so they come in this little leather sheep. Um, sheep. So 
so how sharp do these look? And the handles are really nice with all this sort of, I don't know what you call this, but um, it's just really cool, look. So, um, yeah, I'm going to keep these next to my sewing at all times. Um, they're quite deadly and sharp, so they will snip my threads, no problem. And then finally, um, I got, um, this is really gorgeous, so it's leather, it smells lovely, um, a little teal uh, pouch for storing my needles in, so it's got like a little brassy coloured little buttony thing on the front there, so yeah, basically, I was storing my needles in like a little <laughs> like a little really crappy plastic bag but um yeah so now I'll keep them in here and keep them beautiful and um and kind of know where they are rather than just rolling around in a plastic bag somewhere um so my husband got me that and to go with that he also got me some of these uh tulip Hiroshima needles um and they were all assorted sizes so they're pretty together aren't they packaging um so they come in like a little tube inside there and um so i'm going to keep those in here this did come with some needles though and um so yeah that would be really nice to have some really high quality needles and in this really posh little case so there they are Yay. so that is everything um that i got for christmas sewing wise so I hope you've liked seeing everything. Um, so yeah, if you don't already, then feel free to subscribe and I will be vlogging more as I've got so many sewing plans coming up in the future. So it feels good to be filming another vlog for everyone. I hope you've liked it. Um, and I'll film another one really soon. Take care everyone, bye.